married in June, and uh, feel like he's already kind of gone out of my life. And I was I was gone you know, the last four years on the road, and not sure if, you know the kind of impact I was supposed to be. And I don't know, not the kind of son I want to be, and not the kind of friend, and um, not the kind of bandmate. I just I've always been a guy that puts very high expectations on myself, which can make it very hard to be in a band with me, and um, just just feel like when we've been called to do something, we should do it well, um, whether it's when I was working at Best Buy or was in college, or if I'm flipping burgers at McDonald's or doing the music thing, I just want to, at the end of the day, I want to be able to say that I, I did um, everything that I can do and then kind of let it go from there and let God kind of do what he wants to with it. And it's very humbling for me to be such a small part of the process of what God's trying to do in people's lives. Um, I don't know. I'm a man. I want to see results. I want to work hard and, and see the results and have something to show for it. And uh, a lot of times with this job, I don't. And set, like I said, put such a high standard on myself. I have a lot of, of trouble letting things go sometimes. Even even when the people I let down are over it and, and God's over it, um, I can't seem to be over it and uh, still trying to you know prove myself right or prove myself wrong, you know, one way or the other. Um, I don't know. I, I feel like uh, I'm learning the hard way that spiritual growth has nothing to do with time and nothing to do with age and nothing to do with um, me growing up as a pastor's kid and spiritual growth has nothing to do with my degree and, and nothing to do with good intentions. Um, I guess I kind of thought that you hit this certain stride in life and spiritual stuff kind of comes along with you, I guess. I thought it would be automatic, kind of like growing up and um, learning the hard way. That's not how it works. You know, there's a lot of things that I want to do and a lot of habits I want to break and a lot of habits I want to start um, that I can't do. And that, that blows my mind, like, okay, but, but I want to do it. Like, take God out of it, take my parents out of it, take everybody else out of it. These are things that I set out to do, and I still can't seem to have the self-control to do it. And that, to me, is just evidence that we're very broken and definitely need um, some help from, from a resource much bigger than, than we can give ourselves. And um, Like I said, it's humbling to be at such a, a small part of the process of what God's doing in people, but... At the same time, it's been incredible to be a part of the process at all, um, just to play an important role um, on any level in what God's doing. And, um, yeah, this song is uh, just those moments. I had written this song at the end of college, just kind of one of those moments where those really self-aware moments when you go through something or react to a situation or say something and life kind of throws a mirror up in front of you and you have a very self-aware moment, a very self-exposed moment, and you think, is that me? Is that who I really am now at this point? And I kind of sit in my room by myself and think, uh, that is not what I set out to do. And a few years ago, I would have never said that, or I would have never done that. And um, I don't know. Guilt is something that we all carry, you know, in, on different levels. And um, trying to actually forgive yourself and move on past some things instead of feeling like you got to pay for it um, it's something that I definitely have dealt with a lot. Um, so yeah, the song's called The Earth Falls Asleep. All these songs are on that acoustic CD, if that's your thing. So I'll just be hanging over there by my table. We can hang out. Thank you guys for coming. <coughs> Much too early for me. 
I close my eyes, but I can't rest. My body is tired, my mind is running from the past to the east to the west, trying to find the blame that you've already taken from me. curtain behind which vast realms await us of uncharted marvels and oceans of mercy inside my father's eyes and the mountains are grandstands the sheets of blue sky rest upon Peel back with ease by your hand to reveal a glory I've never dreamed. Can Chosen 